G'day guys and welcome back to the show. Today I'm going to be doing an egg benedict roll. If you love eggs and bacon in a roll, give this one a go. It's going to have maple infused bacon, baby spinach and hollandaise sauce. Alright guys, let's get on with it. Alright, first things first, we'll just get everything out of the way. Now I'm going to be using some maple syrup with the bacon. Um, just to give it a little bit of um, extra sweetness and flavour. Okay. So I'm using streaky bacon, which honestly just gives it a much nicer flavour. It's a bit more fatty. And we'll just put a bit of maple on top of it. Yeah, be pretty liberal with it. You just coat it as much as you can. Then we'll just push this off to the side. So we'll just grab some water. And just get it onto the heat for the poached egg. Right, while the water's going, we'll get the pan onto the bacon. Just add a little bit of oil. Right, pan's nice and hot now, so we'll get the bacon on. Just be careful because it is a liquid into oil. Now the bacon, you can have it as crispy or as not crispy or un undercooked, whatever you like to call it, if you want. I like mine really crispy, but that's up to yourself. Take them off now. Now you can just put it back in the same tray that you had the maple syrup on, just going to add a little bit more flavour. the oil. Being non-stick it's really good, it cleans up really easy. And we'll use the same pan to do the spinach in. Okay we'll just grab the bread roll, just cut him in half. Now while that's done we'll move over to the poached egg. Now, if you've never poached an egg properly before, it's boiling water. Reasonable amount of salt. It adds a little bit of flavour, but it also keeps the heat up in the pan. Then you need to add a little bit of vinegar, only a small amount. You need to put vinegar, an acid or something in there. So it can be lemon juice, can be balsamic if you want. The idea of doing that is it sets the egg as soon as it goes in. If you don't use that, the egg will just sort of start breaking apart and go a bit milky. Um, so with that, it will set the egg, let it sit together, and then you'll have a proper poached egg. Okay, so we'll just grab the egg. Now just get a spoon or a fork or something, and just make a, I suppose, like a well motion. You just want the water just to have a bit of a whirlpool. Grab an egg, crack him in, and then you'll see it holds together. It doesn't actually separate or go anywhere, really. Yeah, depending on how you want the egg done, if you just want it soft, it's probably going to take two minutes. If you want it more hard, probably three or four minutes. All right, the egg's been on for about a minute, so we'll just get the pan back on the heat.
Let's add the spinach. A little bit of salt. And all you want to do really is just work it. So now that it's on, it's on a high heat, turn it off. You don't want to overcook it, you just want to soften it. Okay, that's all done. We can move over to building it. All right, now it's time just to put it all together. So we'll just grab our spinach. Layer that out. The bacon. And we'll just grab the egg out. Just give it a little bit of a drain on some paper towel or I've got a microfiber cloth there just to get the liquid off. Okay. Now I'm going to put a hollandaise on. Now, honestly, if I was at home, I would probably make my own hollandaise. When you're out camping, you're more than welcome to. I don't know whether I would. These ones aren't too bad. I mean, it's, it doesn't taste the same. It's actually made with oil as opposed to butter, but they've still got a good flavor. This one I'm using actually has a bit of lemon in it and it gives it a really nice tang. So when you're camping, it's just so much easier. It really is. And as usual, a little bit of pepper. I do like pepper. Just adds that bit of flavour. So there you go, guys. There is my maple infused bacon egg benedict roll. Now, please, oh guys, give this a go. It is really, really simple. The bacon, it just adds so much more flavour to it instead of just having plain bacon. The spinach, if you don't like it, put it in. Give it a go. You're not gonna really know it's there. It just gives that extra flavor. And look, the egg, you can poach it, you can fry it. I think poaching is better. It does give that bit more flavor to it. Um, if you fry it, you're gonna get that bit more sort of fat content, which you don't really want. All right, guys, looks like I'll have to give it a crack then. Excuse me, what a mouthful. Absolutely beautiful. Don't forget guys to like and subscribe and please comment below. We'll see you next time.